What's up guys, Reckless here, and welcome to Guardian Watcher. It's weekly reset time, so let's go over what is new for this week as well as the gear that is available. So, as you can see, Season 1 is ending soon, so anything and everything that is part of Season 1 when it comes to emotes and gear from Tess Everest, then you might want to get it soon because it's definitely not going to be here for too long. So starting off with the milestones, we have the Flashpoint on the EDZ, which you need to complete public events in the EDZ. If you do the heroic versions of this, you can do it faster. Then we have the Nightfall, which you need to complete the weekly Nightfall Strike. This week's Nightfall is Sabathun's Song, and the modifiers on that are Momentum and Time Warp Anomalies. Momentum reads, Health and Shield Regeneration are disabled while standing still. Sprint to regenerate more quickly. And then Time Warp Anomalies reads, Strange anomalies have been detected in the area. Destroy them to release temporal energy to extend the mission timer. And to start off, we have 13 minutes and 58 seconds to complete that. Then we have Leviathan, which we need to divide the Cabal Emperor in the Leviathan raid. Then we have Clan XP, earn Clan XP in Strikes, Raids, the Crucible, or World Activities. Next, we have Ikora's Challenge, which we need to complete five challenges from Ikora Ray, and you can find her in a bazaar. And then last but not least, we have Call to Arms, which you need to win glory by participating in Crucible matches. So, let's check what Tess Everest has this week for her wonderful Eververse. For the emotes, we have You're the Guardian. And then we have Flowing Dance. For the speeder, we have Skedaddle. For the ships, we have Captain Nemo. And uh, Leonid MV. As for our ornaments, we have Break the Dawn, which is the exotic ornament for the Merciless. I have one, looks pretty cool. And then we have the Red Dwarf for the Sunshot. Armor this week at the Eververse is Legs. So we have the Legs of Optimacy. For Warlocks, it pretty much gives you like spiky like toes, like an elf. For Ghost Shells, we have Two of Diamonds. as well as the vertical shell. For shaders, we have Soros Modular Shine. And then we have Dawn and Dusk. And last but not least for the shaders, we have the Nebula Rose. And last but not least, we have the Fireteam Medallion. Don't forget to visit Cade 6 in order to get those treasure maps from him. This week, the treasure map is on the EDZ. So go ahead and pick those up. And while you're there, go ahead and turn in anything that you have. Whatever you need, buddy. Look, um, no refunds. And that's fellow guardians bring us to the end of the video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like and share it. Feedback is always appreciated. And if you guys have any ideas for a future video, then let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. And remember, less guns doesn't mean less crime. And I will see you guys next time.